Yo guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be doing something different. Uh, so, I'm going to be discussing the drama with Mr Beast. If you haven't heard, um, Lunchly is discontinued now. It's gone and, and, and I think it's mainly too because of the reviews. Um, lots of people have been complaining about Mould being in it. And overall the response to the company has been really bad. So that they're taking out all the stores and it's not coming back for a while or, or ever. I don't know. There's been a lot of drama with that alone. Logan Paul, um, his wife or whatever, his girlfriend was giving birth. Uh, and he used that time to promote Lunchly and Prime. I don't know why he did that. Um, like, he was describing the setting around the room. Here's my beautiful wife. Here's here's the the photos. Here's the bed, and here's the prime. Go to prime.com. <laughs> what? And he also, a uh, lot of people were getting really angry about this. Um, he in the picture of like the full room at the end of the Snapchat story or the Instagram story, it showed his wife really exhausted. In a really small bed, so around uh, just a bit bigger than the width of my chair, um, and he had he he was sleeping with her in the room. So, <laughs> and next to in the corner of the in the photo, it was like t t like twice the size of it. <laughs> like he's clearly not the one giving giving birth, unless he needs room for his prime, obviously. Um, but yeah, that's pretty messed up. Overall, that's just, that's not happening, is it? Next on the lunch of the agenda, we're going to talk about KSI. Um, so, if you haven't heard, he, you probably have heard his new song, um, that he's in the thick of it, um, and everyone knows, apparently. Um, he's, he's called, he, he skidded and they froze, you know what I'm saying? Um, and basically, everyone's hating on it. Because it's awful and it's a very bad song and don't listen to it, okay? Um, and every time someone makes a joke about it, he starts crying. <laughs> like, what? From the screen to the ring to the pen to the king. Where's my crown? That's my bling. Always drama when I ring. And it's like, from the screen to the ring to the pen to the king. It sounds like a Disney song. It sounds like, um... And in the music video, he, he does this thing. He... <laughs> And not only that, due to the huge success, obviously the more people talk about and listen for views to the new song, he's going to get more revenue and he's going to become more popular. It's because I've garnered so much attention, now he's on Britain's Got Talent, replacing Bruno. Uh, so it's Simon, Amanda, Amanda uh, Alicia and KSI next year. He's like, he, he jumps around and he's going crazy and the f and thick of it plays on the stage. It's so funny. Um, I've heard that he's participating in a lot of auditions but he's at, he's only like it's his show like people is is uh, someone's like doing this thing they're throwing things at him and instead of the person doing the act is saying all right guys three two he's going like all right guys three two one um and obviously his songs are playing in the background <laughs> It's like promotional pro, promotional material. BGT, make some noise! Hey, hey, how hey, we doing? Hey. Oh, I oh, love. Oh, we both got the oh, glasses. Oh, I love the, the Simon, Simon glasses. glasses. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! At least we found the worst judge judge than Simon Cowell, so that's great. Next up, and finally, the one that is the main topic of this video, we're going to talk about. Mr. Beast himself, the the millionaire, the, the 300 um, million subscriber guy from YouTube, you've probably heard about him, I don't know, maybe, possibly. We're going to start off with 
the fact that um, his, his group chat with all his crew members has been leaked. In, in the group chat, I've seen the video. I can't really show it on here because uh, um, I need money. But obviously, uh, in the in the group chat, there was pictures um, of um, children, very very bad pictures of children. Um, so we have that. Uh, so so the CP, if you know what that means, yeah. Um, and they use racial slurs. I also can't say that, um, or else I will get cancelled. Um, but the N-word, obviously, so, so things like that, and I made offensive jokes, like 9-11 jokes, uh, um, and they were joking about coronavirus a lot. I'm pretty sure it was around the time of coronavirus, I'm not sure when it took place, but they were joking about coronavirus and the, the flu a lot. And I'm pretty sure that's when it was near its peak, so they're pretty much just making fun of, like, deaths because of coronavirus. Um... But yeah, basically it was just a bunch of dick pics. Ava Tyson, like the weirdest person like ever, um, obviously made jokes and stuff about this, and um, was calling the pictures of the of the dicks quirky, which it really isn't at all. The the, the thing that is very bad, okay. So I'm, I'm pretty sure you know Chris Tyson, Ava Tyson, same person, um, got called out for um, talking to minors back a few months ago, like two or three months ago. And obviously Mr. Beast was defending her, him, they, it, toast driving about this at first. Um, and eventually, um, it, the, the truth came out as confirmed by multiple victims of his heinous crimes. Um, and then he was all sympathetic for the people who were victims to him. They fell victim to him, and it was like, this is very illegal, I do not condone the actions of this. Um, blah blah blah. Um, he has been fired, blah blah blah. He's not my friend anymore, blah blah blah. Even though like a day before he said, he's my friend, I'm gonna... He, she is my friend, I've got to... Defend he, him. Hit her. <laughs> yeah. Um, obviously the hate was always, always coming in because... They were trans. Um, like out of nowhere. He abandoned his wife and kid to do that. But anyway... In the group chat, it turned out... From like for a few months before all of it was revealed, that he was talking about um, how he was talking to minors. I'm pretty sure, um, and there was like screenshots of the chats with the minor. It's like a Vyonka, a Vyonka Trump. I don't know how to say it. At the time of the messages, she was 13, and that was the you know stuff that was being sent. Obviously, I can't show that on here, but I saw it blurred, I think. Um, Mr. Beast has been called out. Uh, he he is probably going to go get arrested. The FBI is looking into it at the moment. Or the FBI, uh, F the FBI are alert about this. They are, and the, all the allegations are coming out about that. Um, personally, I've never really liked Mr. Beast, to be honest. It just seems too good to be true. I'm pretty sure in the group chat they were joking about money as well, how he like didn't always pay the people who were in the videos. Um I'm pretty sure there's a few homeless jokes in there. That's really really disrespectful. But yeah, that, that's it, a rundown of whatever that is. Um so yeah. Um very bad people. Um I'm definitely I'm unsub unsubscribing from him now. Uh, very bad. Oh no, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, um, apart from that, all the people at Lunchly are getting um, on some sort of punishment at the moment. Um, they're all facing criticism and backlash, backlash just, and it's not going very good for them right now. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you want more of this type of video, just say. It's just talking with a few things in the background. Um, yeah. 
Mr. Beast is cooked, basically. Yeah, thank you guys for watching. Um, I'll see you later. Um, peace.